TIG welding doesn't have a lot of room for error as far as the electrode placement. You've got to have it in just the right spot on that bead. And if you're a little too close or a little too far, the results are very mixed. So you want something to prop off of. And I've been propping in the past off of this 2x6 or other pieces of wood, but these leave a lot to be desired. They're rough even on the smoother parts. I guess you could sand it, but your glove will catch on it. They're not very adjustable. They're just not a great solution. What you really want is an adjustable propping bar that can go up and down and turn. So what I thought I would start with at the beginning was I got very excited and I thought, oh boy, I have this piece of half inch hot roll here. Okay, and I have some, this is a chunk of an old swing set that my grandfather originally rescued from the scrapyard, like post-World War II era. So we'll weld this on here and then I'll make a pinch clamp for it out of a piece of some stock like this. And it was just getting rapidly out of hand. And there are some things that I may want to change later. I thought about adding a joint, an extra joint to make it articulated. So there's obviously a second version. And it's starting to feel like one of those projects where I'm going to get frustrated halfway through and wish that I hadn't tried to go to a final solution right away. So we're just going to do one that's a little bit more quick and dirty. And what we'll start with is a piece of black pipe here. It's already pre-threaded, of course. Thread that into a flange. If it was cleaner, it would go on further. And we'll screw this down to a piece of wood, which gives us one other benefit, and that's that the wood will insulate from the table. I've had before where I'm propping, and I have gloves on, and I have a long shirt, but the shirt comes down so there's some bare skin here, and I can feel that AC on my skin. It feels kind of like you're scratching just along a rough surface. It's not really that unpleasant, but I've heard that if you're sweaty or you're wet from dunking something in a tank or whatever, that it can be a lot less enjoyable. So the insulation is a nice advantage. Put that on there. We'll cut off a short chunk of this to make a pinch clamp for here, another piece of black pipe, and we'll stop right there. So that's the plan. Let's build it.